Welcome to All Out Necessity. I am your host, Elo. Today I have cheating ass Myron, yeah. late ass Myron, mm -hmm. and Poncho Bellagio. Yeah. Yeah, you got it right. You got it right. Right, right, right. Send it now while you don't think. You got it right now. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, so we're gonna jump right in. Like I said, mine was late. Um, so before we jump in, this is how we're gonna do it. Because I usually do alphabetical order. I'm gonna talk first, but we're gonna do rock, paper, scissors. So I'm the king of that. Yeah, y'all yeah, do rock, rock paper, scissors. See who go got, first with answering the question. Place I got a gold yeah, plate and uh, scissors at the crib right now. Come on. Yeah, let's do it. Well, are we going right now? Yeah, we're going right now. You, 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 you count, count the one in the rock, paper, scissors. Let's be a team. Okay. One. No, 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 no. Say no. hey, rock, paper, scissors. Okay, rock, paper, scissors. Let me in. Come on. Slow. <laughs> okay. Rock, okay. paper, scissors, shoot, and we okay. shoot. There we go. All right. You say it. I'm going to say it. All right. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Uh, no, you seen that? Uh, on, no, 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 the cameras, no, no, no. Scissors, he, he was paper, he was paper. You saw that, you saw that. First of all, y'all didn't give me a chance to do it. I, I, look, first I threw my hand out like this. can't even let him count. You count. No, she did count, but look, let me Let me do it one more time. I this threw it out it. like this. Come on, That's how I bring my scissors. Come on. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot. shoot. Look, come what on. The? Rock, paper, paper scissors, scissors, shoot. shoot. Yeah, I knew I, I was a brain <laughs> thing. I knew what was going on. It, it, I, I knew right. he wasn't going to never be with cheating ass Myron. In line? Oh, women, okay. not on this. Oh, not no, on not this not, not on games. <laughs> not on games. Okay, we, we see, we see. The cheater is not the master of games. I get it. I get yeah, it. So, I mean, I so what we going to do, because now we're in the lab, which is a segment mm -hmm. about life and balance, we're going to talk about children, right? Mm -hmm. We're going to talk about how you balance your life with career and family and all that. So... You got four kids, right? Wait, I ain't got no four kids. I got one. No, I... I, I ain't got no four. I got no. one kid. You uh, have yeah. one? One. I got one. All right. One. That See wasn't that. what I saw on the tax return. Maybe... No, that wasn't... That, was, that, that wasn't my name. It must oh, be my... A fool, whoever that was. It wasn't Jules. So, it if wasn't they see, me. If they see this, it, it should only be uh, one well, child, well, not well, four. Well, four kids. Said, yeah. no, I got... No, yeah, I got one kid. Yeah, you... you yeah. Okay, so listen. Were you at the hospital when your child was born? Was it a boy or girl? Yeah, it's a boy. It's a boy. It's I boy. definitely was there. I was boy. there, man. You was there? I, I was scared to cut the thing, though. The medical cord, they asked me to do it. But I can't do that. So did you, like, question yourself after you saw how What you mean? Like, did I... It did it, it widened, like. Oh, you talking about uh, like with her afterwards? Yeah, like. like oh yeah, I, you, I'm like, I don't know, I'm finna follow that. <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I know I can't follow that, but my son was kind of tall. Like, I don't want to say long calls, but you know, he was a big baby, like a long baby. He, he but was I was looking baby. at the yeah, and okay. I was like, nah. I don't it's like, I just nah. feel like, well, you know, I was younger too. I'm like, man, it's gonna be loose, boy. I don't know. I, that shit ain't gonna feel me <laughs> no more. That's what you talking about, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was, what I was feeling saying. like. But you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm mm. blessed and highly favored, so I was able to follow her. Oh, okay. After she healed, though. Okay, after she <laughs> <laughs> She had to heal real for a long time, and then, you know. So did that make you respect ladies more because of the process, or did you just, like, oh, you snap back, let's go? What, with the... Uh, like, in regards to the birth process. Was I snap back? Did I snap back, like, let's go, like, what? Like, as far as what, like, let's... Like, did you... Or are you talking about just... Did I expect women just in general? In because general, they had a baby. As, as I far see the process as... Being, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, man, because it's like, when when, when my uh, son and mom was pregnant, like, men, like, first of all, like I said, I was younger, but we don't be knowing what they got to do. I was going to work every day, mm. so she at home. So, in my mind, if I'm going to work all day, when I come home, let me sleep in the middle of the night because I got to get up. You yeah. know what I mean? But she never understood. Like, she would always complain and be like, like, nah, I got the baby all day. If I got to work at 6 in the morning, why well, I got to wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning to make the bottle? Like, you make the bottle. I got to get up and go to work. But she be saying, like, that's how I felt. I'm just being always wanted. But she told me, like, I got the baby all day. Now that I'm older, I, it makes sense to me and I understand it. But back right. then, I was like, man, I, man, we was arguing every morning. What, what's back then? Like, 16, 17? No, man, I ain't know. Like, I, I don't know. How old are you? I was 22. Oh, you were 22? 22. Oh, I was back younger. Then. Yeah, oh. 22. I was 20, 21 by... Just turning 22. About to be 22. I turned 22 right before I had him, because he, he was born seven days after my birthday. Oh, so you're an adult. So, yeah. So, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. It still was back then. I, 
I mean, you acting like you're 50. I ain't 50, but <laughs> I ain't 22. <laughs> this is true. Yeah. All right. So in regards to that, then we're going to move on um, to Poncho. Um, how How is it? Do you, your child live with you, or is it like a... No, my son is in... My son is still in Milwaukee. I just had him for the whole summer, though. So okay. he was with me. So, like, I still get him, like, you know, any break I can get or stuff like that. But mm. it was hard for me leaving him to move here. Mm. But because I was a great father from the time he came out the womb all the way until he was 11, turning 12, when, which is when I moved to Atlanta. Right. It was like, he seen the growth from me, like coming from nothing to starting to get a name and he growing like cause I was always there so when it was time to move obviously it hurt him but at the same time it was like go do it so his opinion was the only thing that really mattered to me once he said it was clear it was good, good. so I was like boom but that's why I go I go home a lot he, he, I go home a lot he, oh. he do too we go home a lot for our kids <laughs> well that's good so Very yeah but it, 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 okay. it's, it, it works out it works out perfectly though with him being older you know yeah. like I said he just turned 14 so he knows what's going on. He's involved and stuff. So, right. you know, so. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's I, good. I did it the right way. I, I definitely want to leave when he was five or six. Oh, that's the wrong way? No, I, what, when he was five or six? I want to leave my son. At, I'm not saying it's the wrong way. It could be different with somebody else, but me, I want right. leaving my son at five or six. I I still had unfinished business with him, I felt like. Right. I had to feel like, he, you know. So. Absolutely. And your blessings come when they're supposed to, so. Absolutely. Probably would have messed it up back then. Yeah, sound like it. <laughs> be back in Milwaukee. I probably would have blew it, be back in Milwaukee right now. I'd be like, man, I, you know what I mean? He gave it to me when I was able to handle it, so. Well, that's it's good. Going fine. Good. Well, Mr. Poncho, um, how many children do you have, or a child, or? I got four. Four. Four girls. Four girls, ooh. Oh, and a boy on the way, five. Oh! Oh, yeah. you you just. Then we gonna come out with a beard. Birth of nations, huh? Are you looking at him? I, because I'm, I'm trying to, I'm <laughs> trying to figure out. To I thought he had the four. And then you the one got the four, I'm sorry, the four and a half. Yeah, no, Soon four and a half. Four and a half. He whole. He So how many months is she? She like, oh. Four months. Three, three. Three months. Three. And you know the the, the I uh, keep up with the month. I do when you when he come, you gonna know what's happening. So you know the sex already? Yeah, I paid for it. I oh. paid extra. You know, you that, can pay, that, you can pay more see, to know see, that's right the then. Difference. That's the difference. Yeah. You don't but have nah, to but to... I still got their paperwork too, like they say a boy. But that was like she no, she probably like four months because she was six months. But they you could do the blood and then she called me got and it. was like, yeah, she was like, hey, you can do it now for this extra change, <laughs> or you can do this. I say, pay that extra change. Yeah. yeah, you ready to know? Nah, so how how does it feel after four girls knowing that now you're gonna have a little grown poncho? Because I'm pretty sure that beard is he gonna, coming. He's gonna, he he gonna, gonna be a star. He's gonna be a star. He's gonna be a star. So how's your relationship with your daughters? You know, they daddy girls. They already know I do All it for them. them. They, I do it for them. I went to court for one. I beat they mama up in court, you know. Oh, yeah. You scared me a little bit now. Yeah, beat her up in court. No, I don't put my hand on women. You got straight No, I don't put my hand on women. My mama died in prison because she killed the man. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I don't put my hand well, on women. That's good. Yeah. Absolutely. So I don't do no violent hit no women. I don't do that because my mama didn't play. She died in prison because she killed the man that disrespected her. Mm. Feel me? And she told me whoever disrespect me destroy him. So it's like I ain't never gonna put my hand on them because I don't know how to if they die. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So I leave you, it'll hurt you. No, I'm a good person. So I leave you and so that's why I hurt you more than me being you up. Wow. Mm. I leave an impression on you. You right, yeah. Okay, so which one of your daughters act like they are in charge? All of them. Every last one of them. Every last one. That's why I said. <laughs> Like, what? Every last one of them. I'm teaching you your own boss. Your daddy here for you. Oh, that's you. what's up. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's like, trust me. <laughs> like, I got daddy girls. Dad she got a, three she got girls a meal. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, the next time I come on this show, I bring, like, as, as long as they're not in school, I bring, right. I let them talk to you. They so. All right. That, that sounds good. They, they'll love that. I, I'm pretty sure they would. Yeah, they, with much respect. <laughs> so with you having four girls and now a son coming, how is the timing with work and family time? And if you're traveling to see them, like, are they here in Atlanta or do you got to go see them? No, nah, I just had my girls as well with my... Oh, in the summer? Son. Yeah. We had a house full of kids. We had a house full of kids. We did pranks. We did, pranks. We did all type of stuff. Nerf we had, so, they had amazing Oh, daddy summer. daycare. Yeah, That's yeah, awesome. of course. Yeah, yeah. yeah so it's right. like, it was cool. It was cool to have them, you know, like I, 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 I told every, you know, my girl's mom, 
that they can let them live with me. You know what I'm saying? I give you a year break. You know what I'm saying? I like the reason being because I want to teach you what a man's supposed to do. And that's good. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, um, actually, I have custody of all my kids because when I took the one to court, mm -hmm. I took the rest. They didn't even they didn't have nothing to do with it, and it wasn't so harsh. But I took the rest. Like yeah. I'm not going through this. Y'all want to play? Y'all think I won't do this? I fought for a whole year straight. I spent wow. twenty two thousand dollars on it. But she thought I wouldn't do it. I went back and forth for two weeks. Every two weeks, back and forth to Florida. Mm -hmm. Playing, playing, uh, playing ticket. Mm -hmm. She thought like I might be in Georgia Friday morning, mm -hmm. but by the time it's court, I'm there. <laughs> She's like, "What the fuck?" You know what I'm saying? Yeah. She with the caller like, "I don't want to fight no more about this." I didn't really want to fight. It was the principle. I go all out by my kids. But right. I still was taking care of them, but I'm on child support. Even though I have my kids for the whole summer right now, I still on child support. I pay eight hundred dollars a month. But that ain't the issue. They ain't got nothing to do with them. Right. They getting old enough to what? Now they know. So it's yeah. like. Now my whole vision that I thought it'd be cool because they're gonna be straight regardless, but it's like now. So now you want to move? Yeah, you. I can't teach yeah. you how to be a woman, but I could teach them the business. You know what I'm saying? Like this, how you go? Because my grandma right. taught me. Nobody else taught me. My grandma and my mom taught me. Not no man. No man ever taught me. You know, so everything I learned that's a man supposed to learn. I learned from the streets. You know? Okay, okay. Well, that's dope. Um, I hope that work out. It's going to work out. For real, for real. It will work out. I promise you that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, li listen, you paying $22,000. I'm pretty sure anything is going to happen. So. I promise you. Yeah. <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. So now, um, y'all in relationships. I, I know you have... Is it a fiance? Nah, mm -hmm. I have a girlfriend. Girlfriend, now. okay. We've been like, uh, she, we've been messing with each other for over nine years. Messing with each other? What that, what that yeah, look like? Nah, I'm saying we've been in a relationship. You know, messing with each other, fucking hell, fucking hell, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm mean, I mean, I'm saying, you, you ain't keeping it real. You know I'm saying? You asked me. I, but I'm saying, I mean, like, I, I tried the, to throw the, it like the that. The proper but, term. Okay, <laughs> shit, like, okay. Um, but so y'all been yeah, no. <laughs> girlfriend and boyfriend yeah. on and off. Nah, we've been nah, we never been. Oh, you just been chilling been, on been, and off. We've been girlfriend and boyfriend for five months. Oh, okay. So but you just we've been doing fish. our thing. For there years. we go. Yeah. So why did it take you so long? Because I ain't want that. But you wanted it, but you didn't want it. Nah, I ain't want that. I just took a chance to myself and be to myself for a year and realized I ain't want nobody new because I'm already financially blessed. I'm already spiritually blessed. I don't need nobody else. I don't want to learn nobody else new. She was cool. We had our ends. We had our house. We had our rights. We had our wrongs. She had a girlfriend all the time. We've been doing our thing. Whatever it was, it's like, I know you, though. You know what I'm saying? Right. I know you're genuine. You ain't perfect, but it's cool, perfect for me, because I already got my own money. I already got my own spiritual rights. I ain't perfect, but I got my own. I'm, right. I'm, I'm my own. I'm like, I'm built for this, and I built myself to where I'm ready for a, a woman. You know what I'm saying? And I still fight my own demons with that, too. She know that. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, that's good that you recognize that, because, right. you know... I mean, everybody, once you bring two people together, you're going to still have to deal with some things. Yeah, so. and I'm learning that now. Yeah. Now, but I'm, I'm learning it, but I'm dealing with it at the same time. Like, I, I like not putting y'all in my business. I don't care. It's just, I want people to learn from this shit, you know, from this stuff. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know I can't live with her right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm finna buy a house, but I know I can't live with you right now. You know what I'm saying? Right. Because we done been together for three months in the same house, and mm. it's like... I ain't ready for that yet. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to make sure you straight, but she got her own house. She got her own. Yeah. She's not dependent on me. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's just more of... Yeah, she's not dependent on me at not. all. Like, I don't do... I, I do I do for her um, what I want to do. Right. And she do for me, you know what I'm saying? Right. To the point to where I got to be like, man, why you bought that? You... Just if you want to spend them 300, give me the 300. I know what to do with the 300. You know? I know what to right, do with right. the 300. You know what I'm saying? Right, we can turn right. the 300 to 325. Right. You live over sure. here. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, you know, we can put a little escrow on it. Whatever. I don't care if it's 15. We can turn that thing to 315 if you give it to me. You. Yeah, but yeah, it's like she don't need me. I'm not putting that, but it's like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I just believe in taking care of my woman and doing everything, but I'm glad that. You know, she moved up here and we had to stay together for a little bit of time for me to understand that. You know, all right now we just gonna, you know, cause I still got some iron stuff to iron out. That's usually what happens when you move in. 
I know, but I didn't know that time I went through it. I heard it all the time, but now I know it. I can tell it to somebody. <laughs> <laughs> that is definitely what happens when um, you move in together. You don't realize that when you're in separate spaces, it's okay. You yeah. miss them. Yeah. But now when they all in your face all the time. Yeah. It's... I just went through that. I said, you got to go home, baby. She, <laughs> she went home for three days. I said, baby, I miss you. Come, come through now. <laughs> Show me how to cook some salmon. <laughs> No, no, I wanted to cook tonight. Come on, do you know what I miss? I say, see, that's what I'm talking about. We both got our own shit. <laughs> I need you when I need you. Yeah, I need you when I need you. Don't, don't pack all your stuff and come here. <laughs> not no, yet, not, not yet. No, not yet. Not I'll yet. tell you when I'm ready. <laughs> yeah, I, I ain't ready. I thought I was ready. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Mr. Cheating Ass Myron. Mm -hmm. you, you taking, you, you in these streets or you taking, which one? Nah, I'm single right now, but I still be messing with who I was in a relationship with. I'm just gonna be over 100. So y'all chilling. So we chilling, yeah, but I still, I, I'm, I, it ain't because of my name. I'm just gonna do what I do until I really know that's what I really want to do. You know oh, what I'm saying? Okay. Like, I'm all the way 100. It's things about the person that I date that I like, mm -hmm. that I know a lot of women wouldn't do for me and stuff like that, especially with me being down here. You know right. what I'm saying? It's like the only motherfucker that I'm close only person I'm close to the liquor and kicked in. The only person, the only person that I didn't got close with, you know, I got yeah. all y'all as friends, but I'm yeah. saying like close to right. where we like we know each other and stuff like that. Right. Is me and is me and Puncho. What you doing? Lenny Kravitz? <laughs> Put the camera on him. I'm just I'm just, playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> No, but like me and Cho, like yeah. we have our ups and down, whatever, like that's what brothers go through. We yeah. boom, whatever. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, even with her. It was like, that's who I fell for. Remember, I, I'm just gonna go all the way through it. Remember yeah. when, I, when I first met her, I used to come, remember I was coming to show. Like, man, I got somebody good, bro. You remember that? I was telling him that. Yeah. When, I, when I first met, <laughs> boom. But then I got, listen, I got with her, and then we gonna go through ups and downs. Right. So I'm like, man, I'm basically like, man, F that, man, F her, man. She like this, she like that, whatever, whatever. But I still, like he said, we fight our own demon too. So right. I still have to look at myself and see my flaws as well. You right. know what I'm saying? And it took a while for me to even do that, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? But right now, we don't have a title at all, you know what I'm saying? So I'm trying my hardest to just be around her just to see if this is really what I want to do, you know right. what I'm saying? Because be sure. mm -hmm. it's a lot of good, but it's a lot of stuff that I'd be like, I don't know if I deal with this. In, you know what I'm saying? Like, right. for life. Right. Like, you feel it, what I'm saying? It will be for life, yes. No, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. So it's like, me being around it, it's like, it's good. Okay, I see this and this and that. If I let this go, there's no other woman that's going to do these things to make sure that you're good. Right. Like, not even just like, I'm not even just saying financially. I'm saying like, if I'm in a, outside of him, if I'm if I'm stranded in a row five hours away, Outside of him, she's the only person gonna come pick me up. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Right. Other than that, I call him, bro. I, hey, I'm stuck out here. Who gonna get me out? He's coming. You feel what I'm saying? That's right. just facts. Right. You know what I'm saying? But just it's a lot of things like that. So I'm trying to learn those type of things to be like, is it me? Because it could be me at the same time. I had to really sit and talk to myself. Right. It could be me outside of the BS that I don't like about that person. You right. know what I mean? So I'm trying to like figure it out and just play it out. Like, okay, is it me? Is it her? And just balance the cards out. You feel what I'm saying? Right. Like, okay, you know what I mean? Because I know the goods, but then yeah. I see the I see the pros and I see the cons. The cons and cons. There's some cons and I be like, man, I know I can't deal with this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But then I have to look at myself too, like, okay, some of the cons, some of those cons are because of my cons. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. If that makes sense. Yeah, it makes perfect so sense. So it's like this, I had to look at it, like, okay, well, person acting like this, whatever, whatever, boom. It's because I know how I've You've been. affected. Boom, yeah. but some of the cons are also some internal. Yeah, because you wasn't all the way honest with me at times or whatever, however it went. You know what I'm saying? So I have a right to be mad at those certain things. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, being 100, he know I ain't been home in like a week. Or probably longer. Or about a week. I went out of town and then I ain't been home in a week. I came home and I let back out because I'm just really trying to figure it out. So if this don't really work, like if it ain't what I'm thinking, I'm trying it. It's like, okay, I'm just gonna really wash my hands with it. And that's the truth. I just watch it like, okay, why am I playing these games? It's not gonna work. Right, exactly. Let me come back and just tend to my rent and keep grinding. You know what I'm saying? But right. this is me just being a grown man, just really trying to figure out if this one is. At the end of the day, every man needs a strong, successful woman by their side. Like, we're not gonna do it by ourselves. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Very commendable. And that's just me knowing that and knowing certain things about the person that you're dealing right. with. So I felt like I should try to see if it'll work. Mm -hmm. with, but there's no title, though. 
No title. No title. Ooh. We're friends. That's, no. that's, st- that's still the hang up, though. No, no, no. <laughs> hang up. No, because. That's going to be one of the reasons no. why it's going to always no. be cons because you're no. you indecisive. You still don't really know. No, this is, no, this is what I'm saying. There's no title right now. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying, I'm not saying I want to do it with no title ever. Right now, there's no title. Well, I'm supposed to just say, come on, let's be together. Like, no. Why I'm, not? Didn't you say no. you were trying to be a man? Like, that's yeah, I can be a do. man. Listen, a man, can, a man can come over there and we can, let's start it from the beginning. <laughs> because what she don't know. No, Puncho, she's not listening. This if, is, okay, so, uh, you so want, let me get in more detail. Commit. Let me get in more detail then. Because you, what you're saying is true, but what you, what I'm saying is that if the person that you're with, right, right. the person that I've been in with, I've only been knowing in life for a year. So I've been through a lot with this person. No, I don't care. Usually you know somebody. Think about what he just said. I've been knowing my girl. Don't but, throw me in no, no, listen, no, no, that's what I'm saying. You've been knowing your girl for nine yeah, years. I no, I, I got a point. You been, <laughs> listen, he been, yes, I do. He been knowing his girl for he been knowing his he girl for nine, nine years, years, and now they're finally trying to do it. But I'm just I, not really getting to try th- to know her. Listen first. what I'm saying. Listen what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I know I'm if listen, I wanna listen what I'm saying. If I wanna but be he's been he's it don't, but listen, at the end of the day, he's still been knowing this woman in life for nine years. The person I'm dealing with, I've only been knowing she's existed in the world or anything for a year, and I ended up being in a relationship with her in three months. I've never moved that fast. So when we when everything was moving fast, it was like it was throwing me. Like, hold on now, like I ain't really ready for all that. Like, and I knew so I, I wasn't. Like, you that fast. I, but listen, my girl, the same one I'm talking to, came to me with that. Since you throw me in here, now nah, I, nah, I, I wasn't fine. in your nah, business. Nah, 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 nah. You you like, I wasn't in your yeah. business. But it, since it's, you throw me not, in here, it's her fault though. No, it's not her fault. I said yeah. No, I'm, I'm going back to the point that you said. <laughs> you said that you didn't want to jump into something and then it was like, it was too fast. She came at me that fast and I told her I ain't ready for that. I told her, I told her straight up, I said, listen, this is my rule. This, not rules. I'm not going to call it rules because we're not slaves. We're not um, to be mistreated. But your standards. But, but this is what I'm going to deal with. Like, if you want to deal with anything else and this too now. If we be together, this is what I want in my wife. My wife has to do these things right here. If not, then I'm not saying I'm not gonna be with you. We can wrinkle out some, but if mo- if all these, if most of the qualities not there, we are not gonna be together. You're gonna be be my friend, and and probably not even that because if I marry somebody else, you're not even my friend. That's what I told her though. To her straight up, I swear to God, if I bring her here right now, I can sit her right here right now, and she'll tell you I don't hide nothing from her, like. Everything and like, listen. This is what's going on, and she said that I'm willing to do that to move forward because I know what kind of king you are. I know what kind of she said your mindset different. It was like, you know, whatever. And I was like, okay, I don't want to find nobody. What I want to do is, which I could have went a whole bunch of places. I'm already financially straight. I'm spiritually straight. My mindset. I know what I want to do. I got daughters that I want to show them that this is how you're supposed to treat a wife. Right. I really want to be married. I've been wanting to be married for ten years. So it's like. I don't want to try nobody else. If I got, if I find something, the reason why I did it, if I get this girl right here, I just met her last month, it's going to take me five years to know her. So listen, look, he just said, but listen, listen. He just said, you know what I'm saying? That's the question though. Why why is it the fact that you got to wait for so long to know if you want to commit? Because it, at the same time, you said three months and you're in a relationship, but you weren't really ready. Why would you agree because, to something? No, listen, that because you it, were it never, it, it was to. never a talk. Let me tell you how it happened, though. <laughs> it was no, it was never a talk. We never sat down and said, "Hey, do you want to?" This is how, this is how That's I break. Point, so if I was dealing, That's listen, let me tell you. If I'm dealing with you, if I meet you today, right? If mm-hmm. I'm dealing with you. Eventually, if three months pass and you tired of just having sex and just vibe and right, whatever, it's right. like, okay, let's go to the next level. The reason we ended up, we, I ended up in a relationship, but I never stopped it. That's why it's not just for her fault, it's mine right. as well. But we was around her friends and family. Every time they said something, it was like, get your girlfriend, get your boyfriend, get your girlfriend. But nobody never corrected. And before you know it, it was like we was in a relationship. And I used to always question my, the whole time. I'm like, how the fuck I do this? But I still never said nothing said because I always ran from stuff. I've been single for like 10 years after my son's mom. So I'm like, okay, let me just try it. Don't run from this one. Let me right. try it. Because she showed me a lot of good things. And then after that, it was like, I started seeing stuff that I was like, nah, I don't really know if I'm ready for this. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So at the same time, I get in my own way too, as well. Mm-hmm. I can be honest and say that. But it was just like, in my mind, like, I don't, I just feel like the first year should usually be fun, having fun, kicking it. And then the second year around, you start going through stuff and whatever, however it goes. But 
with her, it was like the first couple months was cool. Then it was so early into it. Three months, we good. Four, five months, you looking through my phone, you doing all I'm like, why are we doing all this already? This is going too much. <laughs> that's I don't the same care. time. No, no, that's not, no, don't do that in five months. <laughs> Five months, I'm still learning you. No, I, that's not what I was gonna Don't say. Don't go through my phone. That's not what I was gonna say. I was gonna say. <laughs> you going through my that's phone. That's usually the, that's, that through me. Like, oh, you going through my that's, phone? Like, how you know my code? Like, you sleeping on my chest, face. looking at my, looking at me, type my stuff in. Took my code. I'm saying, I'm saying how, how did they find the code on the plane though? You because see, if I'm, saying, if you, listen, because show, I'm not thinking of the glasses on. Listen, did it have the glasses? If I ain't deep, listen. If I listen, that that's how you know those are different type of eyes because I'm not thinking none of that. Because that's for listen, for listen, for five months into a relationship. I'm not thinking you even thinking that deep. How you know what I'm saying? Right? So if I'm sitting there on my phone and you laying on my chest, I'm just I'm just on my phone. I ain't doing nothing. So I'm on Instagram. Obviously, if you land on my chest, I'm not finna text no chick or nothing like that because I know you laying here. But if I'm in my phone, I'm not thinking none of this. Like, that you really watching what I'm typing in? I'm, we on a whole vacation. I don't give a damn. Look, we on a vacation. I'm, I go to the bathroom, take a shower too. I come out the shower. I, I'm getting slapped on. I couldn't even say shit. I'm just like, I'm like, what? I'm like, is this a joke, a prank? I'm looking at it. I'm looking at her face. I'm like, oh, this is real. I'm like, oh, this is real. Like, oh, shit. But I just didn't say nothing. I'm just like, man, you, should, you, get, you went to my goddamn phone. You should go to my phone. Like, you ain't been on me for four, five months. What you looking at my phone for? That's my sister. Don't look at. I'm not looking at a woman's phone in five months. And I'm not looking unless I've been. No, like, and I'm not saying what y'all shit is. To me, how theirs happened, to me, that's how my shit should have happened. <laughs> my girl can't go on my phone. No, right I'm not now. saying that. No, listen to what I'm saying, though. You're listen to what I'm saying, though. Of time. Listen to what I'm saying. But you know what? What? No, I'm saying they've been knowing each other. Bro. No, like, I don't even got nothing in my phone. No, bro. I know that. I know that. But I'm saying, like, you, they've been knowing each other. There, so at the end of the day, done. even though they wasn't together, mm -hmm. they still were know. They still, I guarantee she know him like the back of his hand, uh, back of her hand, and he know her like the back of his hand. Even though they wasn't together because they were still nah, friends. We knew each they other. knew each other. No, no, I'm saying we knew. No, real shit. Me, this woman no. I met her, I don't, I don't think no, about it. Me, me and my I don't girl. know nothing about you. It was moving way too fast. Stop up. throwing me and y'all stuck. I'm not. I'm talking about me. No, look, shut up, dog. Look, it moved way too fast is what I'm saying. To so oh, where man. it was like, if you, in them three months, if you would ask me anything about her, I couldn't tell you. Favorite color, birthday, <laughs> last name, none of that. So <laughs> how am I in a relationship with somebody? If you ask me right now, what's going on? Like, Which is why I asked, why would you agree to it? I didn't agree. It was never agreement. It just happened and I didn't say no. But That's we never the talked. Because no, you never said no. We never talked. <laughs> Listen, we never talked and said, let's be in a relationship. We're going to go to the it's next level. Before you know it, it was just like, we walking around. It's like, this my man. This my girl. And I'm like, how the fuck did this happen? I mean, how the hell did this because happen? Because you let it happen. You're right. That's why I said that's my fault, too. Yeah. So I can't just blame that person. Right. But I wasn't ready uh, and can, I ain't ready. Can I speak? Huh? Can you going to speak and then we're going to take a quick break. Go ahead. He wanted it to happen, but the same thing he told you on the phone, he pride in the way. Uh huh. Yeah. Keep going. <laughs> I'm just. I'm, hey, dude, dude, think he know me, but he do know me. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say like, how long y'all been doing each other? No, no, that's why I met him. Like, I didn't want to say okay. I said, dude, think he know me. And I'm like, but he but do he know, know me. me. Like, no, nah, that's good. Because he know. But no, my pride. I'm, happy, my, I'm flattered to hear no, him talk. I pride, want you to hear this. No, yeah. but my pride, my pride do get in my way a lot. I want yeah. you to hear what I hear. My pride do get in the way a lot. Yeah. Like, I, I know that. But I still That's have to. Money. I still have to know that this is what this I really want to do want. Exactly. because there's still pros and cons in the relationship, and it's other sort of good pros, but it's some cons that I'd be like, it's some real cons that I'd be like, I don't so know. So have you had the conversation? I've like, had the con. Even let me tell you something on some real stuff. Even in the beginning, when 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 it was moving fast, I said it plenty of times. I told her, I said, Hey man, we moving too fast. We need to just be friends first and really get to know each other. We don't know. I said this a lot, but every time. I'm an Aries, I'm stubborn, I'm selfish, I have certain ways, but at the same time, I have a heart. So when I would say that, and that person would say things that make me feel bad, like, oh, you just wanna talk to girls, and I'm like, and it really wasn't that. It's like, man, okay, well, don't, don't run, let me try. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I was getting mind manipulated too. Don't just blame that stuff on me, I'm a customer. Well, we're not blaming anything. No, but that's what it was. I'm telling you, the, yeah. I was preaching that, and it was being told to me, like, that's BS, you just wanna do this, you wanna do that. And it's like, no, we don't know each other. And on that, we don't know each other. On, and on that, though, I ain't gonna lie, a man can easily be manipulated into that. And if any man says that men that can't, I'm not gonna say every man, every man, but I'll say 80% men mm -hmm. get manipulated into a relationship at one point in time in your life. You until that after that time, you might not no more. But at that time, because I've done it before, but at this point in my life, you can shit. You got to back the bus up to get me in there. I'm going to tell you, hey, man. <laughs> well, I 
out but, there. Yeah, I just said. Yeah. So that was saying, it ain't all bad on him. I yeah. get it. No, yeah, yeah but it was like, that's I just, just what it was. hearing him, it's like hearing the skits. Like, he really <laughs> like him. <laughs> that's all I'm saying. It's like, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, yeah. it's amazing. Like, it's him. Like, he, she, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> Well, nah, that's oh my God. Shit. Like, okay. like, it's, that's why it's hilarious to the world. Like, he is that's what I do. Last a billion night. dollars. <laughs> okay, we're going to take a break, but y'all don't go nowhere. We're going to be right back in like five minutes. We're going to kick it again with Cheating Ass Myron and Poncho. And we're going to talk about this beer bomb. That's yeah. what we're going to do. Right. Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. You feeling the show yet? Don't forget to follow, subscribe, rate, and share the episodes. All Out Necessity will be right back. Hey fellas, listen up. Are you walking around here having a hard time maintaining a healthy beard? Your woman complaining because it's ashy and it's dry? We've got just a solution. Bellagio Beard Balm. It's all natural, all organic ingredients for extreme conditioning. So stop by bellagiobrand.com and order you a couple of cans of this amazing beard balm. And trust me fellas, your lady, she will appreciate this. We are back with Cheating Ass Myron and Poncho on All Out Necessity. We are about to get into this beer bomb, sir. Um, it says yeah. all natural and organic. Yeah. What made you come up with your own beer bomb and specifically the title? Um, the I start first with what made me do it is just I'm a businessman. Um, and people was hitting me, asking me, um, I had somebody that I, I actually offered me money to mm -hmm. pay to um like to just use my beer for their beer bomb, and then there was a few people doing that. I was like, okay, okay, whatever, you know, because I really didn't care to have a beer, a beer, you know. I mean, I grow it because my sister always asks me because I grow it and cut it, mm. grow it because it grow fast, so I grow it, cut it, and then she was like, why you don't keep it? Because I always felt like it made me look older. You know what I mean? And then that's when I had my goals, I had a mouthful of goals, you know what I'm saying? I'm in South uh, Florida, so I don't really want all that. Yeah. It's like, you know, I already got a mouthful of goals, so I was like, I don't want no hair on my face. Then I growed it, and um, when I was up here, like after the show, right after the B. Simone show, mm -hmm. and she was like, why you don't grow your hair out? Like, she, my sister kept saying that. <laughs> like, 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 all of them, I'm the, you know, only, I have three sisters, I'm the baby, I'm the okay. boy, the only boy. Okay. So they all like, man, grow your beard, bro, you can do it. So I growed it, and then it started growing, so fast, and I was like, dog, I got compliments and stuff. I was like, oh, <laughs> damn, daddy, daddy. it's over, I'm <laughs> keeping it. Then I just, you know, then from there, I was like, okay, well, oh my God, a beer, people keep saying this, saying this, and I'm like, shit, if I can, you know, if I can make money from it, right. then I'm all with it, you know what I right. mean? So then I um, started practicing my beer bottle. That's why I have to talk with my phone on speaker, because I dropped a whole bunch of beer wax in it. Uh -huh. Because I messed up a lot. I messed the kitchen up. And I went through a lot. Like I went through a lot to learn how to do it, and now I mastered it. Oh, you even became a home chemist. You better if you want your money. Ain't nobody <laughs> gonna do right. it but you. That's right. So um, that little commercial you had uh -huh. with the young man who um, actually put some of the beer bomb on in 15 minutes. Uh, that's my neighbor. <laughs> that's my neighbor. <laughs> and became grown as well as had a full <laughs> ass. <laughs> it wasn't just he grew a beard. He was grown. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like what? What was the concept behind that? It was was it to be comical or was it something to just show like it's really potent? Um, to be honest with you, it was just me. Just I was trying to be creative. Um, I was trying to figure it out. Mm -hmm. And um, after I've um, like it's actually supposed to be launched now, but after like now I started back started reading branding books yes. I'm back on my you know strengthening the mind so I started reading my branding books mm -hmm. and I started reading how do you market things and um I just decided it ain't ready to be marketed. It's that that is not you the want, way to market. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Even though my name is a brilliant name, you right. know, put you know, puts me in the can. It's a brilliant name, but it's a way to market it. And I just feel like the way to market it, God will bring it to me. Absolutely. In my city. Absolutely. Yeah. So I just I, um that commercial I never knew. I promoted it on Instagram, but right. as far as in me putting my putting it out there, my money like, behind yeah, it, yeah, yeah, nah, you, you know wanted I mean? to be right, right. Yeah, I, I ain't Absolutely. gonna put it out for the people to say I got beard bomb, or you know for them saying? to come after you after that little boy with a big ass beard. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like, however, it's just yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. You know, my my motive too it is you know what I'm saying when they come 
have the right Absolutely. for whites, blacks, uh, like whoever, you know? Listen, they hair already grow fast. I don't think they need it. Yeah, yeah, because it's, it's definitely, yeah. Look like, <laughs> looking like Santa Claus around here. Um, Myron, how many cans do you have? Man, you know what? Because you look like you probably nah, look. Nah, nah, nah. Because what you got going on right there grow, nah, looks man, like. I'm going to grow mine. I'm going to grow. I'm, I'm, I, 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 man, you know what, man? One day I'm gonna, I might sneak and use it, but it, it, you know why he sleep. I ain't going to tell him that I use it, though. <laughs> <laughs> if I use that you know, and I woke so, up with a beard, I never tell up. him I use the pussy. You're going to wake up and be like. He's going to be like, what happened, bro? He's going to be like, I know you use the can. I'm like, man, I ain't use that can, man. Yeah, My stuff grew, man. Oh, I'm night. standing on my story, man. My stuff grew. <laughs> yeah, I ain't used the can. You ain't get that one from the strip. You know, he had right, a lot right, of strip. He done tried. He done tried. Right, right. But he ain't eating that one in the can. Like, it's not like. It's still immature. It's still immature. It's immature. It got to come on out. You, you just might need it. No, probably I got three. Chris Cross, man. Oh, man. Everybody got their own different type of beard, man. He got his beard. My daddy didn't. Chris Cross make you. My daddy jump. didn't. My daddy, my daddy never had that. So I know oh. I ain't going to get it. He, he living off old. But you don't know. This you know is natural. Man, man daddy listen. Daddy right now, if I don't let. If I let no, I'm not saying that don't work. I'm just saying. I'm talking about me. Like, when I tried to grow one before he came out with the, the beard bomb. Bomb. That's how you say it, right? Bomb. 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 Yeah. Bomb. bomb. You know, I'm from the Midwest. We say everything. Bomb. I'm the bomb. <laughs> but no. Yeah, even if I let my cheek hair grow, it just be fuzzy and patched and it don't even get thick or nothing. This just looks stupid. That's why I don't do it. This, this is the thick as I get. And this ain't even thick. <laughs> like, this is it right here. I can get a little skinny thing right wanna, here. You might want to try it tonight and just kind of... Test it out, that 15 minute, the hey, that's 24 a, She hour. just helped us out. That's a whole skit for that, yeah, though. The, the, like a skit, listen, even though you ain't doing a commercial, that's a skit to use, like when you talking, and then you catch me in there sneaking the use. Sneaking the <laughs> oh, I mean, yeah. I'm in that one. And then you come in, I try to herb and wipe it off. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like man, everybody using that, man. <laughs> blue magic hair grease. Like, so <laughs> funny, oh my gosh. So <laughs> talking about um, just how you guys um, do so much work together. The idea behind your movie, Day After Quarantine. Like, how did that, I, I was at a premiere, awesome, awesome uh, premiere of video. Super funny, by the way. Everybody loved the the guy who was talking about the boots all the time. Uh, but, Snow. Yeah, oh the, the yeah, employer. That's, that's my, <laughs> that's my best friend. Understand. Yeah. Now, that, that's his best friend. Snow never been in a movie. Snow, Snow is Snow. You mean Snow? Yeah, street dude. That's I'll same. be real with yeah. you. He, that's my best that, friend. He's a street that, nigga. Like, like, he, he, um. Well, I'm saying the same person they seen in that movie is the same person that's you know that's No, that's him. When like, I first met yeah, Snow, him. I met Poncho first, obviously. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Snow's in the car. And I'm walking to the car. He already hanging out the car, roasting the head out of me. I'm like, who is this nigga? I don't know this nigga, but you know, I'm silly too. So I did. I was like laughing and stuff. But I'm like, yeah. boom. And then we went to the Beats of Monster uh, premiere with him. Mm -hmm. Snow just roasting every castmate. Really? Right. He don't. <laughs> Snow don't care, man. Like he just don't care. But it's not in a disrespectful way. It's just yeah. this is who he is. Yeah. He, you see him. He's like, like he, this he, is him. He, this uh, ain't nobody. He, he ain't forcing like, nothing. Like. Like, that's my best, like, that, like, that's my friend. Like, if mm -hmm. anything, you know what I'm saying? Like, he a street dude, like, you know what I mean? Like me, like, I ain't really, like, I do comedy because it make me feel good. Like, right. I don't do it for your approval. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes, like, I might do a video because I I just want to see you laugh. Absolutely. laugh. Because I'm really straight, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, and, and, but I'm, I, like, I'm brilliant in the mind. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I used to knock my bro. own stuff. Right, but, but I'm funny yeah. being me. Yeah. Like, on Be Simone's like... show, I never tried to be nothing but myself. Yeah, we definitely saw you that. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. But that's me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And then, like, I had a time where I tried to change myself to be like, damn, yeah. why everybody don't like me? What is it? But now, for this last peak, I, this last you week, just, I get it now. Yeah. It's like, like I've learned myself so much now mm -hmm. to I get it. It's like, I ain't meant for everybody. To like. Absolutely. I ain't right. meant for you because I'm different. Like, Absolutely. and then I put my, I take myself and put myself on a level with everybody else when I'm not on your level. Yeah. I'm bigger than that. And I try to make myself on your level, and I hurt myself. Right. And now, like, I get it. It's like, forget that puncher. Go for what you want. Go for what you know. You know what I'm saying? Right. And it happened. And that's what happened with my movies. Absolutely. It was nobody believed in my movies. The, the, I the remember first you one, said that, no, yeah. I, I gorilla shot my movie. I shot my movie in the club. I told bartenders. I got them in trouble. I had to pay the club. Man, like, don't no, no fire them. I needed them. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And for me to do that, that showed me the where, and I did it in three days. And that showed me after they took my Instagram. 
So I realized they don't need Instagram. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Instagram ain't helping me because I'm a hustler regardless. Right. So Instagram really taking my hustle time that I could be hustling in the streets. Absolutely. And another situation that brought me back to where to my hustle, my actual hustling ways to mm-hmm. get me off the social media way because I don't see no progress in the pandemic with people. Mm-hmm. And when I say progress, I mean like houses, cars. Absolutely. Maybe I think different, but I don't see no investments. I own stuff. So yeah. like I wanna see what you own. So that now I'm not disgrading nobody. Right. But I think different. Right. So I think better. I think more. So I took this whole year off. Mm-hmm. I ain't doing this for the whole year. I ran more dollars up than I see millionaires I follow. Because you're now focused. You feel me? And it's like, now I'm like, okay, I get it. Because without all this, you can't do it with money, without money. Yeah. If you live somewhere, you got to pay for your lights. If you Absolutely. drive your car, you got to pay for your gas. If your kid got to go to daycare, you got to pay for your daycare. So I don't want to hear nothing. It's not all about the money. With me, it's everything about the money. Hey, of course. Get it? So that's where... I'm at, and when it comes to the movies, it's like, I don't want you to go to Hollywood. I ain't trying to go to Hollywood. Sooner or later, every comedian that's in Atlanta gonna come to me to be in my movies. I promise you that. And I, I give myself a year. What it you- would all be coming to me to be in my movies, because now I took the first two, I took the chance that nobody want to take. Right. You get what I'm saying? Like, right. hear me now. I'm not saying this to be cocky or evident, but arrogant, but I am arrogant, because I, and I am cocky because I know who I am, mm-hmm. man. And it's not cocky to you, it's not cocky to nobody, but when you, if you, Myron, anybody know who you are, you become to know who you are, Absolutely. you are going to be arrogant because you know who you are, you know what you want. And that's the person people fear. And so now I do my movies, the second movie, the day after quarantine that you're going to ask about, I had almost 50 people to 100 people on set every day. I, I saw that and you did have a lot of comedians in right. there. But that came from the first one. And when that's everybody said my movie was gonna be boo, and it looked like it was shot with a phone because I had the one person that I believe in. I had one camera guy that I believe in, but he's a nuclear bomb. Everybody Is it the same it, one? Chip. Yeah, yes. Yeah. He's a nuclear bomb. He turned down, I'm not gonna say because that's his personal business. Right. So much money to work with me because he believed in me. He watched right. me come kid. He said, punch on your mind, it's so brilliant. But he said, get out your way and stop putting people on your level. They're not. Absolutely. And when he told me that, we started. And when this next movie, when I promise you, when they have the quarantine for the come on on the thing, I'm finna go ham with that. Cause I just want you to come see the next one. But yeah. when I see when you see who I go with, I'm going in. I believe it. I, I believe it. I trust. I believe and it. And I, I know that the reason I took this year off, you're gonna see why. And then I'll talk about that. Then you'll see more motivational speeches because I could motivate people now. But you're gonna listen to me more when you see. Absolutely. Because they don't believe in faith. I do. So now I can show them to believe. That's what's up. That's what's up. So I don't mean to get so deep, it, man, no, but I'm, just, listen, I'm on good. another platform you in my mind. You know listen, be, be who you are. I'm <laughs> yeah. not trying to... Listen, yeah. if you want to go that way with it, we can. Just know it's on my time. <laughs> I know. That's why I'm like, I know. No, I ain't good, man, because he's talking, so, he talking some real yeah, stuff. That's why I, I ain't cutting. Say up, but say up. Let but me now, know. I'll, I'll, excuse me, I'll F that, but I'll, I'll pay for the extra 30 minutes. Now. I don't care. I just <laughs> really, I want my story out. And this is just the first one, but I'm. there's going to be a lot of people want to know my story, believe me. Oh, for sure, for sure. We'll definitely have you back. You know, that's, that's always. Um, speaking of movies, so I have this game. <laughs> Oh, I'm scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Ah. Don't be scared. We're going to close it out with this game, okay? So, y'all want to make movies. Y'all want to be actors. What we going to do is... I so, don't want to be. You on a little small talk. Us. Okay, we going to okay. be there. You are. You yeah, are. Yeah, you man. Are Some of y'all want to be, want to be. Don't do that on camera. You are. You are. Right. <laughs> you are Hell yeah. You are movie makers. So, here's what we're going to do. I need you guys to give me the name, the first name of your firstborn, which is your only. Yeah. <laughs> so easy. let's do that right. Makai. How do you spell that? M A K H A I. H A I. Okay. And. Ashaya. Ashaya. Yeah. Ashaya Kelly. You know how I feel? Ashaya. It's harder than Makai. Nah. Look, exactly. A S H Y A. Y A. Oh, it's almost like my name. But you said it right the first time. You said A-S-H. He said, nah. 
Yeah, that's why I was like, hold on. Okay, it's okay. Like, no, 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 you said nah. No, 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 you said nah. It's okay. It's okay. Name your favorite cooking utensil. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, we, we don't cook like that. you pick up in the kitchen? Anything oh, that you pick fork. up? A fork. Okay. And oh, what? cooking utensil? Yeah, like... Oh, not eating utensil, cooking. Eating or cooking. If you don't cook, eat. If I... I, I cook, I'd be doing everything with a spatula. Spatula, okay. Let's do spatula. I use the spatula. <laughs> <laughs> I'm breaking out, man. What is your... I use the, uh... The, uh... What is it called? The, the crock pot? Crock pot, okay. Hold on. That ain't what it's called. It's okay. You said use the cook. Oh, but no, that's what you use the cook. Yeah, that's what I'm used to cook. You know I use the cook. That nigga use everything for the crock pot. I don't even need nothing. I'm throwing it in there. You put your stuff in the microwave, man. You can throw it in the crock pot. That's what he tell me. I got something in the microwave. He like, man, you can, I got you put it in the crock pot. It's going to be way better than the crock pot. Oh, my like, gosh. <laughs> okay, and last, well, two two more things. Um, Favorite bathroom item? Like... So what the hell kind of game this is? I'm gonna tell oh, you. Oh, favorite gotta, bathroom. I like, yeah, what's like, something like, when I'm in the bathroom? Yeah, or, when you're in the bathroom. What's, so it ain't, ain't got to be the bathroom stuff that's hanging up and stuff? No, just like, what? what's your go-to? Toilet to paper. You, you, toilet paper, okay. You gotta, you gotta take your one. <laughs> lotion. <laughs> lotion, okay. What you use the lotion in the bathroom for? <laughs> when I be in there long and you oh. all alone. Got them days, okay. bro. All right. Got all right. Now we getting some. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Hold on, boy. Hold on. Okay. Okay. I want yeah. a sheep butter go. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I said she butter, shea butter, man. You know what I'm talking about? Shea butter. No, they ain't the shea butter. I want a sheep butter go. <laughs> <laughs> I use shea butter. I don't use no shea butter. I'm from Y'all know what I'm talking about. Yes. Okay, so yeah. this game, I had this for a reason because I wanted it to be fun and, and entertaining. So it's called Let's Make a Movie, right? There was another question after that. It is, it is, but I want to tell you the title. So with these next sections, you have to name your your lead actors and supporting actors. Here's the options. You have Denzel Washington, Myron Jewell, Viola Davis, Jamie Foxx, Willie Collins, Regina Hall. Name your lead role. Lead lead actor. Uh, lead, hold on, a lead actor? Yeah. I put myself first. I don't go, damn, Denzel, Denzel, but I'm putting myself first. Fuck that. Okay. Am I going? Yes. I'm going to do Denzel. Okay. I'm going to do myself. God damn it. I know Denzel better than me. I can sit behind the scene. <laughs> I'm cool. I'm That's cool. Really like who's going who's gonna, to who's gonna be the your supporting actor? There ain't no other people again. Um, Regina Hall. Jamie Foxx. Jamie Foxx. Okay. I didn't hear me. And Not you're the Myron. supporting. Oh, you Myron. Okay. He really love you. My we brother, man. Win, like we, we, right. We, we bump All we right. Now, like pick a producer. You have Spike Lee, Tyler Perry, jo Jordan Peele, Will pa Packer, and Regina King. Cool. Ooh. Will Hold Packer. I'm Will. saying the what's oh. their scenario. I mean, um, what's, what's no, they, who's they, producing they, they are producing. It. Oh, okay. Who's producing I, it? I, okay, go ahead. So, na name them again. Spike Lee, Will Packer, Tyler uh, Perry. Tyler Perry, else? Jordan Peele, and Regina King. Jordan, P who is Jordan Peele? That's the kid. He's the Peele. one that did no, um, us, um, <laughs> out, uh, get out. I don't know Jordan Peele. I know the movies, but yeah, I know. he's nice. I know, I know the other people. Me, I just did my so it's, Ty it's Tyler Perry. I'm stuff now. He's stuck. No, 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 tell me again. <laughs> Tyler Perry, uh, uh, Will Packer. Spike Lee. Or Spike Lee. So I'm going to be for there. Just one. I'm going, I know, I know that. Uh, I'm trying to, I got to think, because Spike Lee is a, a legend with the movies back then, but I'm, I'm, he's outdated now. So I'm going to use, and Will Packer be doing his thing now, and Tyler Who you Perry. want? I'm trying to think, bro. I'm, I'm trying to, I got a brainstorm, Will, bro. Yeah, just listen, man. You can't just pick them. I'm picking Will Packer. Okay, Will. I'm In this category, Packer. I'm picking myself. Okay. I got to pick. I'm adding me to the equation. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and... All right, so out of these, out of everything that you've named, now you have to name your movie. So yours has all these names. You have Will Packer producing a movie with Myron and Jamie with a title using Makai Spatula Lotion. 
you gotta figure out how you gonna how you gonna word that to where you can present it and be like, well, I need you to pr- on, I need you to produce this. Hold on, so I get exactly what she's saying, but that's why <laughs> so I made it hard. Gotta, so you gotta use the listen. name. No, this is yeah, what she said. You can't make your own name. No. No. no, 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 no. You, you ain't making your own name in a sense. Yeah, because you Cause made it. You got to go it based has to off. Have of... these, it has to have these, have these three words, though. Yeah. What? You didn't say that. You I said... know. That's the whole point. So, what? Okay. <laughs> you didn't confuse me no, now. No, I got it. Say what, it what, so, all right, I'm going to ask you. Make my new movie with it. Make my new movie with it. Well, do first. I'm going to first. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Do me first. Okay, so you're producing your movie. You're producing your movie with Denzel and Myron. But you have to have a title with Asia. Is it Asia? Ashaya. Ashaya. Ashaya, crock pot, and toilet paper. You gotta create a title with those three in it. You gotta create a title with Ashaya, crock pot, crock, 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 crock pot. I can't add nothing to it. You can. Ashaya. It gotta be. It have, have to have the name Ashaya, toilet paper, and crock pot. And, and it could it could drop off either toilet or paper, and it could drop off either crock or pot. But as long as it's around, it could drop that, one name. It, don't, it could drop a name. Or two. Yeah, names. you could drop a name. One. I got it. Okay. My movie, my, I, but did the, the name have to Talking be like one? me, nigga? Yeah, it has to have, it has to include those words. And, and I could drop one, I could say Ashaya and something else. You're right. Ashaya, I, I say silk. S- hold on. Okay. <laughs> silk. <laughs> so, hold on. No, it's not easy. It's not easy, but I'm definitely up for this challenge, right? Now. Fact. That's silk. Little... Okay, hold on. I'm trying, I'm going to figure it out. Oh, shush, shush. I'm trying to figure, once I get my baby, my name is over. Gotcha. <laughs> I'm fucked, man. <laughs> <laughs> y'all got me. Hello, no, you ain't got me beat yet. Hello. You can Sorry. add words. So I can add whatever I want. Yeah. Okay. yeah you, you gotta have a shy crock pocket and what? <laughs> crock pocket. <laughs> I mean, crock pocket. You must pop. be looking at yours. You ain't tell me Thinking about yours. Yes, Makai uh, spatula and lotion. And you can drop one. What kind of spatula and lotion? Let me think on mine. Yeah. I can't worry about you. I'm trying to help you. I got to think about my guy's spatula and lotion. Come on, we got like 60 seconds. All right, my guy. All right, I'm going to do this. Mm-hmm. Can I abbreviate a piece? Sure. And then with, with the name? No, I'm saying with the name. I got a whole name. Sure. Though. All right, Ashaya, Ashaya, and Ashaya and Silk. But the silk stand for soldiers and loyal killers. Soldiers and loyal killers. Mm-hmm. OK. OK. I ain't got nothing creative. Mm-mm. Cooking with Makai and his spatula. Makai. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking hard as hell. I'm like, man, the best I came up with was thinking with Makai and his spatula. Oh, oh mine is a shire and the loyal killers. But it's a shire like that. And, and the loyal killers. And the loyal cookin', killers. Cookin'. Okay. Yeah, cooking with Makai and his cooking with Makai and his spatula. Cooking with Makai and his spatula. Wow. Yeah, because he do everything with his spatula. No all that shit, all that sound dumb. Yeah, it, man, listen. No, <laughs> listen, you got to think. Makai got a robe on. I, I said a robe. This a thing, robe, this is like a apron. leash. Look, he got an apron on, and everything he cook is with a spatula. That means you got to be a, uni- a unique cook to be able to do everything with a spatula. <laughs> but you got to master that. You got to master that. You got to master that. Master that. Listen, you got to master right. that to get out your first episode. No, 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 no. <laughs> you right. You gonna bring no, it don't episode. matter. You, you can't right. even flip But listen, it. but listen, she ain't something got to do that. She said we got to make up a name. So with her name, <laughs> in my head, he already the king. He already the king. Exactly. He already the king of spatula use. He already the king of spatula use. already the king. So everything he do. Crazy. So he and his spatula. What I say? Cooking Makai and his spatula. Cooking with Makai and his spatula. Cooking with Makai and his spatula. Because everything he cooks is with spatula. He don't use fork. He don't use nothing else. He, everything he do is with a spatula. They ain't gonna understand it till they see the cooking show. Like that. I ain't. Hey, I'm. Hey, I'm mad. I'm spatula. You gonna have me at home trying to figure that shit out? Figure that out. But I ain't gonna let you just beat me up like that. I'm gonna watch. I'm gonna text you a name that's gonna come to me in my sleep. Probably. My best day. Yeah. That you did. You were the. You, <laughs> you definitely. You definitely hey, won that. Hey, can I tell you some real stuff? When I said that, when I said cooking with Makai and Spatula, when y'all laughed, y'all gave me more, more time most, to think. Um, so that's when I said, oh, he do everything with a Spatula. That, <laughs> that was not my mindset when I first made it. Up. <laughs> <laughs> y'all laugh. I was like, okay, y'all. Oh, y'all my go. gosh. Well, that's what creativity is all about. Well, thank you, guys. We're wrapping up the show. So um, thank you, Myron. Um, 
and Poncho. I do wish you all the best in everything family business. I appreciate you for stopping by All Out Necessity. Um, yeah, and stay in touch because I will have y'all back. Oh yeah, you gotta have for us sure. back when, we, when sure. we, we elevate even more. Oh, you know, man. So listen, make sure you stay tuned in every Monday to All Out Necessity, giving you love, life, and entertainment because guess what? <laughs> it's all out now, baby. <laughs>